The two countries are the only waiting for Sweden's offer to participate in the transatlantic military alliance in NATO. President of Turkey Recep Tayyip Erdogan and Hungarian Prime Minister Viktor Orban promised to strengthen the ties after the talks in Budapest. The meeting on Monday marked the Turkish president's second visit to the country in four months. Hungary and Turkey are only two NATO countries that have not approved the proposal to participate in transatlantic military alliance after Russia's Ukrainian invasion. At beginning this month, Erdogan conditioned the approval of Turkey's NATO proposal in Sweden's Congress U.S. Congress in Ankara and conditioned, simultaneously, the two leaders did not comment on the subject at their addresses for journalists. According to the Hungarian president Katalin Novak, NATO growth was discussed during Erdogan's visit. Erdogan's visit is over 100th anniversary of the establishment of diplomatic relations between two countries. Erdogan said, We want strengthen our ties in areas such as defense and energy, which is already our productive cooperation. Erd Erdogan said that two countries are currently aiming to increase the trade volume of two countries from $4 billion $6 billion. A horsepower for 435 Erdogan. Novak and then Orban before entering a meeting with the heroes of Budapest was taken military honor. In the square, Orban presented Erdogan gift of the Nonius horse Turkish leader fell from a horse in 2003. Gift from one riding country to another. Orban wrote on Facebook. On the other hand, Orban was presented with an electric car a photo of Turkey in X. The best deal I have ever made. I bought 435 for a horsepower. Welcome to the president of Hungary Erdogan. During a joint press conference, Orban said that his country is looking for allies we can win. The great plan is that in the 21st century, Turks and Hungarians will be victorious together, he said. In recent years, Hungary has followed a policy of opening not only towards Russia, but also to China and Central Asian countries. Central European countries of nearly 10 million people are only European Union member states that have been closely tied to Kremlin since beginning of Ukrainian war. In Sweden's NATO membership, Budapest shook Stockholm on open enemy attitude ve and accused the Swedish representatives of repeatedly willing to print Hungary to Hungary. Orban told Parliament to Parliament in September that the approval of Sweden's NATO proposal was not urgent.